Want to know why it's called fine wine? Because old wine doesn't taste bad. Want to know why he's older than her? Because girls are programmed to like old wine. <laughs> Yeah, that's not funny. Fan One is a movie from Nollywood that really wants to challenge the negative stigma surrounding age gap in relationships, and that's good. But is it the first movie to do this? No shot. Rich Trigger Movies was the first movie to ever do this. And guys, this movie is a masterpiece. I don't like it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why did Netflix not buy this movie, man? Nollywood is famous for making the same type of movies and hoping their fans won't catch them. And in most cases, it's not the writer's fault. It's actually Nollywood's fault. You see, Nollywood was raised on romance, so no matter what story you want to tell, trust me, it has been told before. Interracial love? Done. Lovers competing in the same election? Done. A superhero movie that has a lot of copyright infringement upon it? Done. Fan One is a story that hits too close to home for a lot of ladies in Lagos. A 24-year-old NYSC intern that works in a bank and is also able to get the attention from a rich man. Come on guys, that's my sister's story right there. On the other hand, Rich Sugar Mommies has an entirely different story. It follows a 19-year-old. That's a joke, guys. It follows a 16 year old. I would have to praise Fine Wine for doing things differently. He's a single father of two, so that means he's not cheating on anyone. Left to me, the sugar daddy has to be married to the most faithful wife in the world, so anytime he cheats, we, the viewers, would lose faith in the marriage system. But on Sugar Mommy's side, things are working differently. This is how you pay me back by cheating on me cheating on you. That guy is obviously cheating. <laughs> I love how he talks like there's a full stop after every line in his script. I didn't cheat on you. I am not covering up anything. That person that said this must come and prove it. Wealth is one major asset for Shei's character. He is so rich that everyone in the movie can't fail to tell us about how rich he is. Congratulations on making Forbes Africa 100 most influential African. I don't blame them. He's on the Forbes newspaper and his TV has a front camera. If you do the math well, this should not be possible because for her, this is what she will be seeing. Not only is the mass wrong, but these two should never work in a perfect world. She's conservative in nature, he's conservative also, and that makes for a boring relationship. He genuinely cared about me. He always made me feel like- Shut up! You don't know what you need! Her relationship with her boyfriend actually says a lot about her, more than it says about him. If he's treating her this bad and the relationship is remotely new, then she also has issues in regards to how she picks her men. She gave him so many chances, again and again and again, even accepted to marry him. Come on, man! But you're trying to tell me the point she realized that he was bad for her was when he did not notice her new hair? Wait, um, you were saying something. Why did you go to the salon again? <laughs> I don't know anything about her. It's not a week. <laughs> Sugar Rich Mommy, on the other hand, is so in tune with culture that she is chatting with her friend on Togo. How did they get that app? <laughs> no one knows. They're so good at telling stories that he gave this babe a letter, and in his voicing, he perfectly showed what a paragraph should sound like in her head. Listen, the more you refuse to respond to me, the more I get attracted to you. And the education goes on because this is how numbers should be written down in letters. My name is Jason. 08060. And 8. This right here, guys, is a better movie. Hands down. Netflix failed me once more. Honestly, Fine Wine isn't a bad movie. It just has a lot of flaws. Casting RMD is the safest bet for a movie like this. 80% of Nigerian girls are already in love with him. That, that doesn't make it hard. Cast someone else. Cast an old man with big stomach and watch how the negative comments will come. Her mom is not good. Yes, I said it. Who allows their kid sleep in another man's house? Wholeheartedly, eh? Who? Who? Tell me who this guy is. Who is he? Why have I never heard of him before in my life? Why would you name your wine business Fine Wine? Wine signifies exoticness. That's not even a word. Not simplistic. S -s -s. That's also not a word. Was it a feel good movie? Yes, it was. But do you know what the part two should be about? 
Blackberry Babes. <laughs> <laughs>